previously on the dragon ship. There's, there's two types of girls, right? There's the girls that you marry, as Thor was pointing out earlier, and then the girls that you just play with, the plaything, you know? Um, the problem is, and, and Thor, Thor and I have already had this conversation on um, a previous podcast where we're like, guys love hoes. There's not a guy in this world that doesn't love hoes, okay? Every guy would bang the hottest hoe in the world if she threw her vagina at him and said, bang me, please, Okay. Nobody just wants to marry the hoe, you know. Nobody wants to marry the promiscuous woman that 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 is going to be that thing, you know. Nobody wants that. So we could at least say that, you know, when it comes down to dating or being promiscuous, nobody has a problem with it until the problem is theirs, right? And can we really? Because we tell guys to go out there and spin plates and go out there and you know get experience. But we tell women to keep their chastity. So who are these women that these guys are supposed to be getting, you know, you know, uh, experience with? Well, the three or fours. <laughs> exactly. That's exactly what I said. I told Phil that last night. I was like, look it, the three or fours are the ones that everybody got to go, you know, get experience with, and then they take that experience and they find their good girl, right? Well, yeah. I, I don't think it makes them bad people. It's just a question of if you decide to have an LTR and if they do too, whether or not they can adhere to that because it's so easy for them to jump to another guy. Now, of course, there's exceptions, but it's like a woman who's only been with maybe nobody or one or two guys, she's invested in that guy. She doesn't, it's not easy for her to jump to another. It's just like the alcoholic who takes a drink. Once he takes that first drink and more, the next one's easier, the tenth one's even easier. It's the same concept. Once you've been with 10, 20 guys, huh? I'll just go find somebody else. It's like when you go into the grocery store and, and, and Thor and uh, Wraith can remember, we used to have a couple selections of chips. Now you got 50, you can't decide which one to get. There's so many different chips. So does everything. It's the same way with that woman. She's only used to one guy or two guys. She's not really just all ready to jump out and try this guy, another guy next. She'll stay or she's willing to invest more to work on it more. At least that's been my experience. If you haven't already, join Thor's The Dragon's Membership. It's a men's monthly interactive meeting in cyberspace. This is a mask on place for men that is censorship free to help you increase your performance, converse as well as leverage ideas, and get coaching consultations on how to handle life's issues in a modern world. This is a unique place. This is a discreet place, and it's a place for men. So what are you waiting for? Join The Dragon's Membership today. This production was produced and edited by Glenn Lawrence Presents. It is 100% copyrighted and owned by Glenn Lawrence Presents Media Publications. For further information, reach out to Glenn Lawrence at Glenn Lawrence Presents on YouTube, Instagram, and all other social platforms for inquiries on work.